The South Snohomish County Fire District is asking the county now to, or the county council, I should say, to pass a ban on fireworks. But as Callie Greenberg reports, some people who sell fireworks say there's a need for education and a ban won't necessarily stop the problem. We've got the fish one. In just a few weeks, firework stands will be popping up just in time for the 4th of July. At the same time, South Snohomish County Fire will ask the county council to consider this. If we know something is going to happen, uh, which we do, we know that there will be injuries this year, we know that there will be fires, it's our job to protect the public and we start by putting a ban on that. Uh, Interim Fire Chief Doug Dahl said the department will ask the county council to ban fireworks for part of unincorporated Snohomish County starting in 2021. This is where the stand's going to be here, start opening on July 1st. For Anthony Ramirez, selling fireworks is a passion. You know, in 2018, I sold over 10 tons of fireworks uh, in, you know, in a six day period operating in Snohomish and Monroe. He says customers, they come from all over the county and was disappointed to learn about the proposed ban. It's, it's a tough call, right? I mean, unincorporated Snohomish County, I live there, so I would be banned from lighting fireworks and I'm selling them. South County Fire has been asking the county council to pass a ban for at least 10 years, saying since 2005, they've seen countless accidents and have spent almost $4 million fighting fires caused by fireworks. When you're lighting a fuse on something, uh, accidents happen. Anthony does his part, making sure his customers understand the dangers of what they're buying. It's a big responsibility. I mean, uh, you know, if it's a dry year, a wet year, it doesn't really matter. He wants South County Fire to look at education efforts before taking away an activity. He knows so many enjoy this time of year. The, the 4th of July block party that changes dramatically. You know, do we all drive somewhere and watch? It's not the same, just not the same. Callie Greenberg, King 5 News.